Hi, so we're having a party. That's great. Have you thought about the guestbook, the video guestbook? Here's what you do. You take an iPad, you put it on a stand, and it's going to have these messages to get attention from the guests passing by. They tap the screen, and oh, look what it is. They tap to press record, and they're recording a video message. If it's a wedding or a birthday, whatever it may be, maybe business getting some feedback. They record their message, and this is a self-managed video solution. So this handles everything for you. And when they're done, they can just press stop recording, and it's on, well, there's the thank you message, and it's on to the next person, getting the attention of the next person passing by. So this app for iPad, also available on iPhone, is called Guestbook Go. And it's meant for these events where you want to gather video messages. In an, in an easy way. And it looks like this. You have a title and a subtitle and the preview so the guests can see themselves recording. And then there's a go button with a small timer. And the go button is the only thing that the guests can press. So it looks very basic, but it's very powerful. And you can customize this any way you want, depending on the event you're going to have. So the settings are that you have your title, and your subtitle, you can set those. The thank you message and the idle screen messages, the message to get attention. You can set those in any language, even though this is English, it's multi-language support. You set the font from a list of fonts and the color of the font, and then you have the background. There are three choices for background, either a single color or an image from the gallery. You've seen a few here, or you can have your custom image from your own photo library. Now this is gonna stretch the image to fit the screen. And a pro tip is to actually have Guestbook Go running on your device and then the device you're going to use at the event and then do a screen capture and design around the video preview and the Go button. Any fonts, labels you want. On top of this, you have animations. You can have no animations or you can have stars, hearts, bokeh, or balloons. And you can set how much and how fast these are going to move. And then there's the time control. Now this will automatic, automatically time out. And that's important because you don't want it to be stuck recording when nobody's leaving a message. <clears throat> so you can set the timeout to three minutes and you can also en enable an extension so the guests can tap the screen to record a little longer. And that extension can be up to 60 seconds. So that's how easy it is. A video solution for your event. When you do, have the event, you want to set the uh, iPad up on a stand and you want to have good lighting on the subjects from like the behind the device, especially if there's lighting in the background and put it up in a corner where guests aren't too disturbed by other things. And then you start the event and there's a button you press that will highlight, which will make the screen go to 100% brightness and it will disable the auto lock on the device so it's always going to stay on so you press the start event button and that's when it starts uh, hides the other buttons and starts the event now it's recommended that when you do have the event and you set it up guestbook go is running that you activate guided access now you set up guided access mode in your device settings and then when you have guestbook go running you can activate guided access and that will make sure that nobody can swipe or push a button to leave the app. So the app is going to be running all through your event. Uh, so that's what you want. And then afterwards, you can disable guided access with your pass key, touch ID or face ID. So that's how it works. Very easy. If you have any questions, uh, leave a comment in the description. And uh, if not, if you get it, good luck.